Hey guys, welcome back to some more Tennis World Tour and part 45 of our Let's Play and in today's episode we start the French Open or the Paris Major and we'll be playing Richard Gasquet on home turf. He beat us in straight sets here last year. It's going to be a tough one to get through but hopefully we can and uh, yeah, without further ado, let's get into it. Thank you for all the support on the series so far really do appreciate it and uh, yeah uh, I'm looking forward to, to getting into this uh, as I said earlier in the week if you are interested in retro gaming or whatever please do subscribe to my other channel Captain Goodspeed Retro which was launched earlier this week and that's where the top spin for Let's Play will be continuing as well as uh, looking at all the new tennis games such as uh, the original Top Spin which we've done before and uh, um, and the Smash Court tennis uh, games and things like that but uh, for today's episode let's get into it. Now Richard Gasquet we actually played really well against last year I think we well I think it might have been straight sets or or at least uh, four sets that he beat us in, but that's a good start. It is a, a little bit laggy to um, start off with. Hopefully that's not going to be a, a continued thing. Hopefully it'll be something that resolves itself. We have had issues with uh, some lag in the past. Shot there. There we go, it seems to be smooth again. What a rally this is. Man, we've won it. We're always going to be impressive on indoor courts because we're, we're so attacking. But uh, we're up to 17 in the world now, which is our highest ever ranking. Uh, on the back of a quarterfinal appearance at the Madrid championship and a second round appearance at, uh, at Wimbledon we'll be looking to continue that sort of form in this tournament and that was a really good start for us there and we're really attacking the baseline uh, at Richard, Richard Gasquet and hopefully we'll be able to keep performing at that level Wide. Obviously, we we did have quite a poor defeat uh, in the last episode to to John Isner, uh, straight sets, and we were never really in it, to be honest with you. So um, it'll be good to go out there today and and hopefully improve on that performance. We already. Seem to be playing at a higher level. 15, <laughs> yeah, good shot there. He's got to keep the pressure on the return. 15, 40. As he said, two break points. Yeah. And he gets the break. Incredible. So a great start for us here. Oh. The forehand goes wide. Not enough control. Oh. Oh. Brilliant. Back 
He's feeling good. Good serve there. Got some noise coming from outside. Either somebody trying to start the car or emptying a drain or something like that. Apologies about that, but not much I can really do. Deary me, two laps in a row here. Oh. That's wide. And you got to say, perfect start for us. 3 0. Absolutely brilliant. Playing like we did against Gotham, if you remember. In that first round of Wimbledon, absolutely flawless first set. Yep. We've just got too much power for Gasquet at the moment. Shot. It's impossible to get it by it. Fifteen. Thirty. Oh, nice serve. Thirty all. Way it's in. Not the time to flinch. 30 40. Oh, we were about to attack that forehand there, but it was out. Yes. Oh, double fault. Wow. Well, four love within five minutes. You've got to say it. This is uh, slightly unexpected. But I do remember um, when we played Gasquet, and uh, I remember we got off to a really good start. It might have been 5-2 uh, up with set points and ended up losing 7-5 in that first set. and We never really recovered from that, but uh, I think we've come a long way in a year and you know we are a lot more experienced. We've uh, actually won matches at this level now and Beaten top players. Well, Goffan's our best career victory so far. I don't know whether Go uh, whether Gasquet would overtake that. Um... That second serve. Kind of so, disappointing second serve. Done it. Well played. Now, Rochelle Gasquet, after seven minutes, will serve to stay in this first set. Oh, what a shot. He just picked it out and went for it. Good shot. Brilliant. Three set points. Can he do it? Three set points. We've completely dominated this first set. Um, I'm hoping he, he doesn't double fault here, but he doesn't. But we've got the court here. Yeah. We 
done it. What a set of tennis for us there. And in eight minutes, we have absolutely dismantled Richard Gasquet in that first set. And he only won five points in the whole of that uh, first set. Only hitting one winner. Absolutely crazy. But, you know, we need to um, improve our first serve percentages, most definitely. You know, 78% is really not going to win us the tournament. And we could do with getting that up into the 80s. And, you know, those two faults are not going to help early on in the second set. drop shot and there's no way he's going to reach that. Go. We've gone running all over the court at the moment. Again. Not hitting the first serve. He isn't stepping into his court. Again, not a first serve, so, oh, second double fault of the match. And we are struggling with our serve, and it's not usual where we do nowadays. It was something that plagued our early career, but it's been something we've been proud of recently, but that... Is a good point. New balls here. That's seven love, really. I feel like Gasquet has to win a game soon and start playing. At the start of the second set with new balls, that's a perfect opportunity to do so. What a second serve that was. One of the only times he's gone down the tee. Yep. That was technical perfection. Body, love. Well, there you go. Gasquet is on the board. Let's hope that doesn't signal the start of him playing well. We've got to start getting first serves in if we want to continue dominating this match. That's wide. Finally, we get a first serve in this set. Oh, what a shot. What a shot. Mm. It's really poor from us. It's not often we play a shot like that. Shot there. Fifteen. Nice. Incredible power. Absolutely dominant on serve. Oh. making a few more unforced errors than usual or oh, we did in the first set I mean that is a terrific 
shot. It's silly, but <laughs> it was fun. This one just cupped our hand round it and went for it. Brilliant. He's got to seize the opportunity. And a break point here. Now we weren't expecting it. Thirty love down. Oh, what a shot. What a return that was. A return winner. And we've got the break. I mean, it only just landed in from him. And, yeah, we just hit a perfect return. 3-1, second set. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Again, just struggling with first serves at the moment, which is unlike us. Mm. Our serve is just off. It is off. Luckily, we're still managing to win the points. 30, 15. Brilliant. Yep. Break consolidated 4 1. Take a look at that back end. It's absolutely Love perfect. 15. How was that serve in? Great shot. Doesn't matter. That's brilliant. Two break points. Two more break points here. Done it. Incredible. And well, after 16 minutes in this match, we're serving for a two sets for love lead. Thanks, one. That could be out. It is. It could be out, and it's just hit the the tram line. Dear me. Come on. Yeah, brilliant. A box in the forehand.
Two chances to finish the set. Bogey, 15. Two set points. And we duly deliver two sets to love up after 18 minutes. Absolutely fabulous tennis from us, but only 45% first serve in that second set. We were really, really struggling with it. 21 winners. He all, all, more than doubled his points tally for the set, 11 there. Um, but as you can see, we took the two break point opportunities we had. And we're, we're doing pretty well. It has to be said, at two sets to love up. If you have enjoyed this episode, then make sure you do leave a like down below. It really does help me out. It means a lot to me as well. Subscribe if you would like to see more. And I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Thanks for watching and goodbye.